Alright everyone, and welcome back. I'm Christina, aka The Variety Nerd, and today we are jumping back into, well, more WWE 2K20 My Career Universe mode. <coughs> Gotta apologize if once again I'm coughing quite a bit. I have this lingering cough from a cold that I just, like, I had the world's worst cold as I kind of gave it an update a couple episodes ago. Still lingering, but as you can s sort of tell, I am basically about 98% better minus the stupid cough. Either way around, if you hear coughing throughout this episode, that is me. I am keeping hydrated as much as possible, so I am practicing self-care. Uh, so yeah, last episode, which I also uploaded today, uh, probably right before this one. Last episode, we were in the heat of Mixed Match Challenge. Uh, we went to Super Showdown, had some really cool gear, all that kind of all that kind of good stuff. Uh, and so we kind of determined a bracket for this tournament that you will see in just a second. So yeah, throughout the episode you'll be seeing the updated brackets as we kind of go along, so that way I'm not confused, you're not confused, now that it's like a more traditional tournament. Uh, so yeah, get excited. So it's not going to be all mixed match challenge stuff in this episode, we'll have a little bit of an ongoing feud a little bit along the side, you know, kind of like as a side mission almost. Uh, so get excited, that way it's a little bit... <coughs> that way kind of breaks things up a little bit too. So without further ado, let's jump into some Monday Night Raw action as always. Go hit the, go hit the subscribe button, yeah I can totally talk. Go hit the subscribe button, go hit the like button, please leave a comment. If you are enjoying the crap out of my career universe mode just like I am, um, yeah, keep up the support. I very much appreciate it. And without further ado, let's get this party started. And Natalia just coming off of a huge win against Lana just now. Let's see what she's got to say here tonight on Raw. I know it must be hard for all of you to understand this, since none of you have ever accomplished anything worth remembering. But when you're at the level I am, people come after you all the time, and that's why I'm out here tonight. So people want to mess with me, and the way they think they can get that is to insult me and degrade me. They have to be out of their minds to play with fire like that, but guess what? I'm going to give them what they want, what, the, what the, they're looking for. So she will learn her lesson never to mess with me ever again. Well, who's messing with you, Natalia? Who hurt you? If there's one thing I've learned in this business, is that you have to do whatever you gotta do to keep yourself alive. Well, good lord. You fight day in and day out. If you can't back the- What? If you can't hack that and go take- Then go take up knitting or something. Me? I was born to fight and I'm the best, but Christina Jacobs, you don't have what it takes. That is quite interesting, all things considered, since the two will meet up in two weeks' time and their mixed match challenge, you know, tournament match. Again, Natalia teaming with Samoa Joe, Jacobs teaming up with Drew McIntyre. But will Jacobs answer the call here tonight? We'll find out, hopefully very soon. Yep, here she is. She's making her way up to the ring, you know, maybe grab a microphone, talk some crap, we'll see. Alright folks, this is going to get good. These two haven't met in the ring, like, one-on-one -on -one before, so I'm going to assume it's probably about Mixed Match Challenge. We're, we're going to see. She's just, like, glaring her down, good lord. Alright. I know you weren't expecting me to come out here, but I just couldn't help myself. You and I have some business to attend to, and I couldn't think of a better time than now. And if you listen to these fans, they seem to agree with me. And I agree with you too. <coughs> Is that really how you want to start your interruption? There are so many more interesting ways to interrupt another superstar. This was way too boring. Go, try again, but this time be more exciting and original. I mean, okay, originality, sure. Me coming out here right now is actually a compliment. You can sling whatever comments you ha want in my direction, but it's not going to solve anything. 
You know how we solve things here in the WWE? So think about that for a moment. Right, it's like Natalia, you of all people would know how they solve, you know, how everybody solves things in WWE. Well, to be fair, I mean, there's probably been some weird matchups over time. This is the most painfully annoying experience in my life, and it's all your fault. You need to get the hell out of my ring before I somehow make you uglier than you already are. There's no place in the women's division for you, so get the hint and take a walk. Again, that's a theme that uh, Jacobs has been going through this entire series. You know, people have been saying that she doesn't belong, but she's been trying her best to prove that she does belong out here. I came out with a purpose, and I'm going to deliver on it. I'm throwing down the gauntlet and challenging you to a match. I want to know, hell, the world wants to know which one of us is the most dominant superstar in the women's division. So let's do it. I don't think she could have gotten more clear than that. Let's see what Natalia has to say, if she has to say anything. You might think I came out here looking for a fight, but you're wrong. I came out here to see if you were worth a fight. In my opinion, you're not worth a fight. In fact, you're not even worth me coming out here. Well, you were out here first. You just had a match, Natalia. Like, you kind of called her out. I mean, you know, uh, what? Oh, all right then. See, this is what I'm talking about, WWE Universe. You're all smart. You know how to pay attention. You all know how to read between the lines and listen to words not said. You know the difference between action and inaction. See, she understands the WWE Universe. She understands the people. Take that, John Laurinaitis. We have the return of people power. If there's one thing I've learned from standing opposite of you in this ring tonight, it's that you could use a mint. Seriously, gross. You, haven't you ever heard of a toothbrush or mouthwash? I'm not going to fight you tonight. How can I fight someone whose breath is almost an instant knockout? That's an unfair advantage. Wow. Okay, it sounds like Natalia's kind of going off the rails a little bit here. Can all of you believe this tonight? I did everything I could tonight. You all saw that, but she... It didn't even seem like she's mentally here. What a total waste of an evening. Sorry, everyone. Maybe next time. I mean, she's not wrong about that. Not at all. And welcome back to Raw. We got a huge show coming up here tonight. And of course, at the end of this week, we will have an updated bracket to see what's going on over on the SmackDown side of things for Mixed Match Challenge, heading into Survivor Series. But let's see where we're at here tonight. I'm at, I, I get, I, again, I look forward to seeing where we're at. Sheffield, England. Okay, I guess we're going on the European tour, question mark? Oh, here we go. And here we go. Matchup about to get underway. Title contention with a victory here tonight. Ooh. Alright, so Christina Jacobs is scheduled to take on Ruby Riot here tonight. But what? what is Natalia doing? Natalia just laid out Ruby Riot. Oh my god. It looks like Natalia does not want to wait until next week to get her hands on Christina Jacobs. Holy crap. What is going on? Well, I feel like I just answered my own question, but it's fine. I guess we're getting this matchup a little bit early, at least a sneak peek into, well, next week's action. Oh, Natalia! Not holding back right off the start of the matchup here. And Sharpshooter versus Crossface right here. Very interesting. Two very submission-oriented women similar in style but very different in terms of experience levels that sort of thing will that help natalia or will it hurt her again natalia taking out ruby riot just now before the matchup began again jacobs was originally supposed to take on ruby riot but is facing natalia these two will be mixed match challenge action next week with their respective tag partners as well, so. Either way, we're getting a sneak peek for next week's mixed match challenge tournament action, which, you know what? That is fine with all of us, I think. Right, right. Oh! 
these two have met, of course, up in action with Mixed Match Challenge, but they have not faced each other one-on-one -on -one yet, which is quite an interesting dynamic. Springboard cross body. <laughs> okay, I was like, wait, can I even go up there? Oh, okay, not sure what was going on in that. Oh, Vitaly with a huge kip up. What's Natalia looking for here? Again, Natalia's strength and power advantage. Trying to show off for that crowd a little bit. Here in England. Natalia going for the cover. And a two count. Jacobs kicks out at two. Natalia arguing with the referee per usual to try to see what was going on there. Again, we're seeing this vicious side of Natalia. Will that pan out to her advantage? We'll find out. Again, a very last minute change in opponents. We're not sure if Jacobs has experienced this before, but we're gonna see if, you know, she's battle tested essentially. Exploder suplex from Jacobs. Going to the top rope. Again, very much more comfortable in the air. Oh! Oh, what a counter right through the ropes! Oh my god, what a counter from Natalia! Northern Lights. <coughs> Holy crap. That momentum just shifted into Natalia's favor here, folks. Again, going for that cover. And a kick out. It's going to take a lot more for Natalia to bounce back up from that. Huge suplex. Another near fall attempt. Kick out. going to take quite a bit for Natalia to put away Christina Jacobs, the former NXT Women's Champion. That we all keep forgetting about, myself included, because it was like, ah, oh, man. Oh, and a one count for Jacobs on Natalia with that huge Tiger C-Plex bridge pin. Oh, what's Natalia looking for here? Oh, and the submission move. Oh, okay, this is interesting. And some good ring awareness from Jacobs, easily getting to the ropes and also going outside the ring. And the action's outside the ring right now. Jacob's trying to get a little bit of separation from Natalia. Once again, going to the high rent district. Oh, God. And another counter. I don't think Jacob's has planned this out quite well. Again, that inexperience factor might be kicking in here, folks. Natalia, a lot more experienced. The veteran of the women's division here on Raw. Alongside, of course, Alicia Fox. Oh, but what a counter from Jacobs right there. Huge suplex going for the quick pin. Good strategy. And a near fall. Again, these two will meet up in mixed match challenge tournament action. Playoffs action, I should say. Next week. Both of their partners will be in action later on tonight. That referee's in the way, per usual. Huge insiguri. Jacob's trying to get a little bit of momentum on her side. Huge kick to the arms. Snapmare takedown. Huge baseball kick to the leg. Going to that middle rope. Oh, and misses the leg drop. Natalia rolling out of the way. Natalia going for a huge backbreaker. Oh, God. And she's really going to town on the back and the torso area of Jacobs right there. Huge counter from Jacobs once again. Oh, and a huge springboard DDT. Let's see what she's up to next. And a near, in a cover. <laughs> it was like a near cover. <laughs> I can't talk, it's fine. Natalia getting up to her feet before Jacobs. Let's see what she's got in store here. Oh, and a huge knee right onto Natalia, followed by an exploder suplex. Jacob's trying to get some momentum on her side from the crowd here tonight. 
And she knows that she needs to target those limbs because otherwise Natalia could get that sharpshooter in and it is game over. Again, first time these two are taking on each other one-on-one -on -one here tonight on Raw. Again, Jacobs was supposed to take on Ruby Riot, but that clearly just did not happen. Natalia, counter. And another suplex. All the blood's rushing to Jacobs' head. That can't be good for anybody at all. The referee is just kind of, you know, kicking back and, you know, trying to stay out of everybody's way. Natalia trying to get some crowd momentum on her side. Jacobs trying to use the ropes to her advantage. But Natalia, huge springboard suplex onto the mat. Natalia going for a pinfall attempt. And a one count. It's going to take quite a It's going to take a lot to keep Jacobs on the ground. Oh, Natalia is getting real angry now. And Jacobs getting wisely, I think, getting her into the ring again. There's a referee! We could not tell what just happened. I think it was a front drop kick. We're going to have to find out, I think, right? What you looking for here? She's looking for it. She's just looking for the clover leaf onto Natalia. And Natalia taps out. What a huge win for Christina Jacobs. Again, she was supposed to take on Ruby Riot here tonight, but Natalia, of course, getting her nose in everybody's business and taking out Ruby Riot. And holy crap, my freaking headphones just got so loud. Holy crap. Well, that explains. It was like all the way at 60. Good lord. Usually I only have these at like 30. Somewhere between 20 to 30. But here we go. <laughs> Sorry about that, folks. My headphones just like exploded on me. But yeah. Uh, a huge victory against Natalia. We're going to see if that momentum carries on into next week's big mix match challenge playoffs match. Really weird right there. But yeah, uh, Jacobs, of course, getting more and more experienced by the week here on Raw. And taking down an opponent of the caliber Here's like Natalia is quite the feat. Jacobs. Natalia, of course, staring on a defeat in the ring. Let's see what's next. All right, Bob Lashley is out here. Uh, Bob Lashley, of course, uh, losing last week's Mixed Match Challenge match uh, alongside his partner, Nia Jax. And uh, they were in a losing effort with Seth Rollins and Becky Lynch. I have to be honest with y'all, I love coming out here. No, I really do, because I know that you're looking at me and my greatness brings all of you and your small, unfortunate lives a little bit of joy. That makes me feel good. What you can't see is of course Bob Lashley has brought back, of course, the, ravis the ravishing Russian Lana. She's kind of tucked away in the corner just admiring her Bobby. <laughs> God, that was so cringeworthy. <laughs> I'm sorry, but like, you know what? It's fine. Everything, <laughs> Everything's fine. But yeah, Bobby's out here flexing away. Just really bringing it to the WWE Universe here tonight. I don't need to prove myself to anyone, but if I have to compete against the best and I can't compete against myself, then I guess you'll have to do. So come on out here, Drew McIntyre, and let's get to it. Of course, McIntyre and Lashley, lots of history. We're going to see if McIntyre comes out here. Yep. Well, we're hearing his music. Oh, God. I just, like, almost tripped over my headset, and my apologies if I sound like I'm all over the place. It's fine. Everything's fine. I just need a tissue, because my life is just in shambles right now. Again, cold and flu season is not fun. 
But here comes Drew McIntyre, of course, these two former running buddies alongside Baron Corbin and probably ten other people for a little while. I was starting to lose track, I'm not even joking. But here we are, Drew McIntyre's like, alright Bobby, enough's enough. <laughs> He's just like, not having it. <laughs> That's great. He's absolutely not having it with good old Bob Lashley. I don't know why I keep calling him that. Dude, I tried telling you this last week, I can't believe you weren't listening. Now I have to come out, school you, and shame you in front of the entire WWE Universe. So be it. There are some hard truth bombs I gotta drop on you, but if that's what it takes, put your mic down and be prepared to listen. Oh, snap. You know, I'm, us I'm not usually the type of superstar to complain. I don't have much to complain about. I'm talented and awesome, but this nonsense, this I might have to raise my voice over. You're really pressing your luck messing with me like this. You'd better speak up and speak. <laughs> the mannerisms are crazy hilarious. I'm sorry. This is great. <laughs> this is great. Every time you open your mouth and say something, I can feel my brain cells fading away. I can feel myself becoming actively more stupid than <laughs> around you. Well, to be fair, Bob Lashley is only like just, you know, just flexing away and just go, I don't know. But I, I'm losing brain cells too, Drew. Don't, don't get me wrong. I'm equally losing brain cells. While they have tried, the authority ultimately doesn't have any authority over me at all. I'm a free man, a free agent, to come and go as I please. So they can't manipulate me into dropping my focus from you in the same way they can't manipulate the situation to save you. That is the simple, stark reality. Yikes. Not sure where the authority came in. Here's a little secret. You're not... You're just not good enough. That's why you don't want... That's why you don't get what you want. The WWE Universe knows it. I know it. Hell, I think even you know it. But look, if you still want to get your ass kicked, I'm always happy to dish it out. See, like, at least Drew's making sense. Bobby's going all over the place here. <laughs> Sorry, pal. You're barking up the wrong tree here. Maybe your mommy and daddy raised you to think that throwing a tantrum is how you get your way. No dice. Come back when you have some talent. Bob, what are, what are you doing? You would think that being with Lana would actually, like, help him out. Oh! Oh! Oh, Drew was not having it. I'm here for this. Just go get him, Drew! <laughs> breaking, breaking news. I think we're going to get a matchup out of this for our main event here tonight. Wait. What is Lashley doing? Folks, this just went off the rails real fast. I'm here for it. This is great. Again, these two former allies, running buddies, I believe... Who are they running buddies with? Baron Corbin? I feel like that sounds about right. I've lost track, okay? They're, I feel like they were, like... All of the heels were, like, on one team at some point. Alright, we're spilling things out to the outside. Again, we're just kind of just sitting back and watching how this pans out. Oh! Oh, right into the steel steps. Not sure what Bob was trying to do. <laughs> I don't know why I keep calling him Bob Lashley, but here we go. But oh my goodness. Wait, are the fans like turning on him or something? Oh, and folks, got ourselves a matchup up next. At least in our main event, I should say. So we'll be seeing these two in just a little bit. And here we go, folks. Main event time here. Bob Lashley calling out Drew McIntyre earlier tonight. Will Lana be out with Lashley? We're going to find out soon enough. But this is our main event, folks. Bobby Lashley, Drew McIntyre. Let's go. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by the ravishing Russian Lana. Yep, from called Colorado it. Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 200. Oh, they're even matching. Pounds, the almighty Bobby Lashley. But here we go. 
Bobby Lashley, Drew McIntyre. You might be wondering, Christina, why the heck are you going this direction? Well, it makes sense. You want to show a united front, like if you're going into a big tournament playoffs match. That just makes a little bit of logical sense to me. And plus, also some logic, well, Lana's going to get her butt involved in like half this match, probably. So there you go. Get some momentum on your side, that sort of thing. But let's see who's going to win, Lashley or McIntyre. We're going to find out, so. Oh, God, my headphones just went to like freaking 100 or some craziness. Okay. I try to keep my volume to like 20 to 30 because I still want to be able to hear what's going on. But Jesus Christ, it just like exploded. But yeah, uh, a heads up, this is going to be a little bit of a lengthier episode uh, because we are uh, in a six-week build-up to Survivor Series. So I hope you all have been enjoying the mix Match Challenge component to it. Want to do something different and something I would not get sick of or, you know, not enjoy. And quite frankly, they really botched that quite a bit. And his opponent See, there we go. Weighing in at 254 pounds. I just want to make a comment that they didn't even announce, like, the created wrestler manager. I'm going to have to play test that and see if that works in other, or does not work, I should say, in other modes. Yeah, seven patches deep, and, you know, we're still, you know, some things are not fixed. But here we go, Lashley, McIntyre, La Lashley calling out McIntyre earlier tonight. And, of course, good old Bob Lashley got attacked because he wouldn't shut up. That's basically what happened. At least that's how I interpret it as. <laughs> Bobby Lashley was kind of going off the rails there for a second. I'm like, what's going on here? Oh, God. But here we go. Main event time. Lashley, McIntyre, of course, got the managers involved. So he's sort of even things up a little bit. Oh! Collar and elbow tie-up. Lashley's got McIntyre in the corner. Referee trying to get in there. Oh! Huge strike from McIntyre. Oh! The, ref the referee's down! Alright, uh, referee's down. Bobby Lashley taking advantage here. That referee's gonna be down for a little while. I can, I can sense it. Again, McIntyre's tag team partner, Christina Jacobs, had a match earlier tonight with a big win over Natalia, who took out her original opponent. Original? -er? Original opponent, Ruby Riot. So, hopefully, you know, we can have a match. Hopefully, we can get a win. Why is. Why are we going after that referee? Well, the referee makes me angry in this game anyway, so, I mean, it's fine. But yeah, uh, for some reason, Lashley had a bit of a beef uh, with Bob. Lashley had a big beef of Drew early. I can't talk. It's fine. I just know I'm enjoying the crap out of this, and that's fine. It, it looks like I've already recorded for like an hour, and it's probably like 10, 15 minutes into the video. I just take like really long breaks. Oh! Again, former partners slash allies uh, kind of going at it. Big main event, pun intended. They're just countering each other left and right, and I'm here for it. Literally, me, I'm like, I just did not expect that to happen during that promo. I'm like, alright, go get him, Drew. <laughs> Honestly, that sounds about right. <laughs> I mean, Lashley kind of was going off the rails a little bit. Less. Lashley countered. Big counter for McIntyre. Oh! Again, I need all mix match challenge. Folks involved uh, need a little bit of momentum whenever they can get it, whether that's a title opportunity, a big match like this. Every little bit counts. Basically, everybody's matching, too. Like, I don't know if that was planned or what, but here we are. Snapmare takedown onto McIntyre. 
Lashley trying to dig his fingers into something, I think his shoulder. I can't tell. It's hard to tell from the monitor. And a huge counter from Drew. Another huge slam. He's trying to make quick and easy work of Lashley, and I kind of don't blame him, but Lashley just will not stay down. Drew with a huge counter right there. Again, if it ain't broke, then don't fix it. Lashley with a huge counter. Oh, huge counter from McIntyre. Another huge counter from Lashley. Another huge counter from Drew. Good lord. They are like reversing everything from each other. And I'm kind of here for it. Lashley countered. I thought he was going for like the butt thing again. And I was going to get like really concerned. And smart ring awareness from McIntyre getting some space from Lashley. <coughs> oh, punch him right off the apron. Okay, this could go off the rails very quickly. Lana's already making her way over there. Lana, of course, supporting her Bobby, which that's kind of cringe to even have me say that on commentary here. Slash, you know, even saying that as a form of commentary. Oh, a huge headbutt. Oh, God. Six. Oh, a huge counter. And the action goes back inside the ring once again. He's got the arm. Lashley with another counter. I swear to God, I'm not doing this on purpose to spam moves. I'm just saying. Oh! Oh, God! I swear to God, I do not mean to move spam. I really don't. I'm not like this. Unless if I'm playing in towers mode, and then it's like, all right, we're going to do ten strikes until they counter something. Alright, McIntyre going for the cover. Oh! Ring awareness on Bob Lashley's behalf right there. Very wisely grabbing the bottom rope. Oh! Okay, I don't know if like he actually connected that, but okay. Oh, huge move over the top rope. What's he looking for here? Oh, and a huge suplex. Oh, last it with the Irish whip. Oh, oh! Huge spear from Bob Lashley right there. This is awesome. That was awesome. All right, go for the pin, Drew. I don't even think he had a finisher or anything, but okay. But holy crap, Drew McIntyre just totally got up right away after that spear. That crazy freaking spear. Clearly, it's going to take a lot to slow either one of these two down. Oh, spill over to the outside. Oh, Lana's getting involved.
Lana once again being a very distracting person, just in general, getting her nose involved, just because she can. We were not going to end that match on that note, folks. This match has been restarted by some sort of, you know, higher up. I don't know who that might be, whether that's Mr. McMahon, whether that's, like, Triple H. It's got to be somebody. Oh! Huge counter. Another huge counter. Oh! Also, I think a better question is, how in the world was Lana able to, like, do that maneuver? Alright, somehow McIntyre going up to that top row doesn't do that often. And I don't know what just happened, but it's fine. Even <laughs> timekeeper and Greg Hamilton. <coughs> Drew's getting back inside the ring. Lashley's just like crawling right at Jacobs' feet. Like feet. I almost said foot, but it, it's really feet, but it's fine. Alright. <coughs> We're gonna see if this pays off for McIntyre here, folks. Lashley, of course, kind of struggling here. Kind of struggling. He's trying to get on his feet once again. Again, momentum riding on this match. Heading into next week's Mixed Match Challenge. I think Drew's looking for it. He's looking for it. Oh, oh the Claymore! One, two, three. Okay, why was Lana just like cheering for that? Like, is there something going on with her and Lashley that we just don't know about? <laughs> of course, you can also see here Lana getting her nose involved as much as possible. But nonetheless, McIntyre picking up a huge win here tonight in the main event here of Raw. Is Oh, it's Samoa Joe! Joe, of course, uh, being the uh, one of two opponents heading into next week. Oh! What's going on here? What's going on with the managers? What's going on with the referee? What's going on with Lashley? What's going on with everybody? No, I'm just getting really confused. I think... What is even going on here? Again... Joe and Natalia, of course, fighting. Wait, why is Lana trying to go after everyone? I just got so confused. But in, like, the best way possible. Alright, once again, Natalia, Samoa Joe, taking on McIntyre and Jacobs next week in the first round of the playoffs. And the winner of that match will take on Seth Rollins and Becky Lynch in a few weeks' time to see which Raw team will be going for Survivor Series brand supremacy at, well, Survivor Series. And welcome back here to Monday Night Raw. We will be kicking things off with a huge matchup here. That's been kind of bubbling the last couple weeks. We got our second of two Survivor Series Mixed Match Challenge playoff matches coming up first things first here on Raw. Here in England again. I guess we've kind of just stayed over in England. I don't know what's going on, but okay. And here we are. We are kicking things off with a huge playoff tournament match for Mixed Match Challenge Brand Supremacy Survivor Series Edition. Natalia Samoa Joe, of course, trying to take their opponents down a peg the last couple weeks the here on the Raw. is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Natalia. Natalia in a losing effort last week, but that's not the big statement. Natalia two weeks ago calling out Christina Jacobs. Uh, Natalia kind of went off the rails a little bit with her promo, that sort of thing. Samoa Joe, of course, uh, last week was interesting. Uh, he kind of came out and kind of attacked everybody. Yeah, that sounds about on brand for Samoa Joe. So, <laughs> so between <laughs> uh, Natalia also sneak attacked uh, 
Jacobs' opponent for last week, Ruby Riot. So we might see those two kind of go at it again at some point. We're not sure. But more importantly, the winner of this week's match will face the team of Seth Rollins and Becky Lynch and in two weeks' time. From Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds, Samoa Joe! Oh, God, my ears hurt. Holy crap. At least my ear hurts. Yeah, my ear hurts. Should probably go take some Advil or something because of my sinuses. But here we are. Um, Samoa Joe, of course, interfering. Well, not interfering, I should say. Attacking. Uh, trying to attack, I should say. Uh, Drew McIntyre and Bobby Lashley last week. After McIntyre defeated Lashley, after Lashley kind of also very much more went off the rails, calling out Drew for some reason. Probably because he got salty that he lost. Him and Nia Jax lost that previous week. But the winner of this match will take on Seth Rollins and Becky Lynch in two weeks. The winner of that match goes to Survivor Series to take on the winner of, well, SmackDown's Mixed Match Challenge. SmackDown slash NXT because there is still one more team in there. We'll see if <laughs> that kind of comes to fruition. <clears throat> I'm fine. Everything's fine. Ohio. Christina Jacobs. I thought Greg Hamilton said Loveland, Ohio, and I'm like, well, I did live near Loveland, Ohio for a little bit, like when I was an undergrad. But here we are, Christina Jacobs pulling out a huge win over Natalia last week. Uh, just, oh god, she's like almost went right after her! Oh, that's great! Oh god, this is great. I love how, like, between her and Drew, they just keep, like, bulldozing into everybody, and I'm kind of here for it. Again, pretty much just two people that kick everybody's butt just kicking everybody's butt. That's what a mixed match challenge should look like, okay? So again, lots of, lots of, <laughs> God, lots of bad blood kind of brew in between all four folks in these, in this matchup. Again, the winner of this match goes on to the somehow, like, semifinals of this crazy tournament. And they will meet Becky Lynch, Seth and Rollins. Get excited. Air, Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, Drew. I'm still trying to figure out how we ended up in, like, you know, England and then the UK and everything for, like, three weeks here. I guess we're just all doing an extended, like, you know, European tour, potentially. I don't know. Uh, but to give you an update, if you, if you didn't check out the updated bracket, uh, Sasha Banks and The Miz actually pulled out an upset over Braun Strowman and Alexa Bliss. Braun and Alexa were the front runners of the SmackDown bracket, so I'm interested to see where SmackDown side's going to. But for now, if, you know, the winners of, the winner of this matchup, the winner's winner, I don't even know, winner, winner, chicken dinner, there we go. My, <laughs> my own commentary started to go off the rails a little bit, but we're having the women start off, of course, these two got some bad blood. Jacobs has a one-on-one -on -one victory over Natalia after Natalia kind of ambushed Ruby Riot last week, who was the original opponent. Uh, and the winner of this match, they well, winners, I should say, will be taking on the team of Seth Rollins, Becky Lynch. That referee needs to get out of the way. Oh, God. That referee was once again in the way of Jacobs pulling out a huge springboard attack on Natalia. And Natalia taking advantage of that, being the veteran of the two. Jacobs proved last week that it was more or less about taking control of opportunities and proving why she belongs on the roster. Again, the big overarching thread is that, like, everybody's trying to vie for those spots to go on to Royal Rumble and thus WrestleMania, why they're in the title pictures, that sort of thing. Jacob's standing on the apron. We're getting very close to Samoa Joe, which is a little concerning. What's Jacob's got in store here? Oh, and a huge Hurricane Rana right on Natalia, and of course Natalia kips right up. Not even phased by it. Oh, and a huge running DDT onto Natalia. Natalia, of course, trying to get over to the corner, but the fast and frequent tags. Uh, Drew McIntyre, of course, uh, getting attacked by Samoa Joe last week. Uh, before getting the upper hand onto Joe. 
Joe with a huge Samoan drop. <laughs> Definitely some, you know, not some great things. Not so great things. Of course, Jacobs was indeed there for that match last week. Kind of evening the odds against Bobby Lashley, who in turn, uh, I don't know what just happened, but okay. I'm really confused, but here we are. But yes, uh, Jacobs was indeed out there for that main event last week to kind of even up the odds a little bit. Good Lord, Samoa Joe's like trying to throw everybody into her. I'm not here for it, Joe. Nobody is. <laughs> Samoa Joe just keeps like barreling into everybody. Right, McIntyre gets the tag in to Jacobs. Jacobs, of course, stopping Natalia. What are, the, what are these two looking for here? Just kicking the crap out of them. Fast counter, or fast pinfall attempt by Jacobs on Natalia after that huge kick and a one count. Mojo on the outside of the ring. Oh! Oh, and a huge counter. And a huge poison rana from Jacobs on an Italia. Again, the key here is to try to make fast work to get to, <laughs> to get to the semifinals. <laughs> the semifinals. Next week, the finals will be at Survivor Series again. Best team from Raw, best team from SmackDown will be duking it out. So we'll see what's going to unfold, but for right now. Very dominant showing from Jacobs and McIntyre here. Uh, Samoa Joe, uh, definitely not the... You know, Natalia's not in the freshest position right now. Huge counter. Another counter from Natalia. Natalia's got Jacobs in the corner. Tagging in Samoa Joe, very wise choice. Not sure what was going on there. Don't ask me. Huge backbreaker from Joe onto McIntyre. Not sure what was going on there. Huge counter. Oh, and a huge Russian leg sweep type of thing. Maybe, no, that was a back DDT. Backwards DDT. Something like that. <laughs> I've tried. I'm trying, my friends. I am genuinely trying. Joe wisely getting out. Huge clothesline from McIntyre. Trying to get him back into the center of the ring. Closer to his corner. Very smart decision. Oh, Joe countering. McIntyre taking in Jacobs once again. And what are they looking for here? Oh, huge double DDT and Jacobs with the pinfall attempt right here. And Natalia with a one count. My God. <coughs> Natalia with a running front drop kick right there. Huge Meteora from Jacobs. Jacobs looking for her finisher right here. Looking for that front DDT. Oh, I don't know what was going on there, but apparently Natalia just was not having it. Natalia just going after Jacobs with all the elbows and chops. Guessing she kind of ducked out of the way. I don't know what in the world happened. And Natalia making the tag into Samoa Joe. Oh, he, oh God, like I hurt just like seeing that. Oh, and a big counter from McIntyre, another counter from Joe. Oh my God, these two are countering everything. 
Can we get the Fight Forever chant? Because I'm starting to, like, get those vibes from, you know, this match. Oh my god. Alright. Here we go, folks. Here we go. Oh, and the Claymore. Oh my god. Oh, and Joe kicks out at two. Holy crap. Samoa Joe just kicked out of the Claymore. Holy crap. Not too many people actually, you know, counter, the, or at least kick out of the Claymore, I should say. Jacob's very wisely tagging herself in, running front drop kick. Getting the tally up under her feet. Oh, and right into the cross face. Oh, but I guess Joe broke it up. I can't tell what just happened there. Oh! And Joe just basically tossing her to the side. Another huge meteora from Jacobs. Can wonder this match will meet the team of Seth Rollins, Becky Lynch in two weeks' time on Raw. That, either way, that would be a great main event no matter which team goes on. Jacobs going to the top rope. Oh, oh God, and she had some really good air on that one, too. <laughs> oh, God, and a huge German suplex. Holy crap. Oh, no, what's Natalia looking for here? No! Oh, God, Natalia's got it locked in. <coughs> but what a counter from Christina Jacobs. Oh, God. She just countered the sharpshooter knowing that she had to get out of that very quickly. And Natalia getting Jacobs into her corner. And Jacobs trying to get out of that predicament right there. Huge German suplex. Let's see what's next. Trying to make a comeback. Oh, and Natalia stops her in her tracks. Oh, what a huge kick. Oh, God. All right, what's she looking for here? She's looking for... <laughs> She's looking for it. She's looking for it. The springboard elbow drop and going very quickly for a pin. Oh, and Natalia gets a two count. Oh, wait, Jacob's getting a two count. Natalia kicking out of a two count. <coughs> oh, and a double underhook suplex. Oh, God. Oh, and a huge clothesline from Natalia. Oh, and McIntyre getting involved, breaking up the pinfall. What's Natalia doing? Just bringing her up to her feet. Oh, and a huge counter. Oh, another huge counter from Natalia. Oh, Natalia misses. Oh, small package. Oh, and she kicks out at one. Oh, God. Jacobs is not looking good here, folks. Not at all. But she counters. Not even caring that Samoa Joe is right there. Like, that is what we stand for here. Oh, huge counter. Oh, very wisely getting out of the ring. I think. Getting some space. Huge. Oh, huge counter. Jacob's wisely rolling out of the ring. Getting back onto her feet. She needs to make a tag to Drew here. That's kind of the predicament that she's in right now. 
Will she make the tag? And yes. Oh, and met with another huge elbow. Drew catching him right in his tracks. Oh, God. <laughs> What's he looking for here? Huge pile driver. Oh, another counter from Joe. Again, these two are just countering everything that they've got. Huge belly-to-belly -belly suplex. Oh, God. Even the referee's like, I'm not messing with this dude. Not at all. What's McIntyre looking for here? Oh, and the future shock DDT. Oh, and Natalia breaking up the pin this time. Oh, God. Jacob's, of course, trying to regroup a little bit here. And Joe with another huge counter. And McIntyre with another counter. Oh, God. And Joe making the tag into Natalia here. Oh, God. And they were both just, like, sprinting for each other, too. Jacob's, of course, taking advantage of the slip-up. Oh, and a huge head scissors right into the canvas. Can Jacob's capitalize? Oh! Natalia counters. Oh, and a huge running front drop kick from Natalia. Back body drop. Jacob's wisely getting out of the ring. Going for another Hurricane Rana. She might be looking for it again, I think. All right, she's going for it. Referee's in the way once again, but a huge springboard elbow drop. And Samoa Joe breaking things up for his team once again. What just happened there, but that was kind of cool, I think. Oh, and a huge counter. And Jacob's realizing that could have been the only option just to tag in her partner. But you know what? That is what these tag matches are here for, folks. And this is. <laughs> opening match on Raw. A match of this caliber probably could have been in the main event, but that might be in two weeks time. First McIntyre here, taking advantage of the brief slip up from Samoa Joe. Oh! Oh! He's got it in! He's got it in. And Jacob's breaking up the submission attempt. Oh, God. That coquina clutch. And Joe's going for it again. Can McIntyre hang in in there? And Jacob's again breaking up the coquina clutch. How much more does McIntyre have in him? Oh, and sensing it this time, McIntyre is... Oh, God, no. Oh, and he sensed it right there, folks. Oh, my God. Good Lord. Oh, my God. What a match this has been. Holy crap.
this might be the only, this might be the opening that McIntyre needs for his team right here. Can he connect? And a Claymore right onto Samoa Joe. Oh my god. What a match. Oh my god. And somehow he got out. How is this man doing it? Just how? <laughs> oh my god. Folks, what a match. Like this. I feel like Meltzer would probably rate this match like. 10 stars or something ridiculous like that because everybody's getting out of their finishers. Samoa Joe is somehow kicking out of like two Claymores. Drew's not having it anymore, folks. He really isn't. And Joe's trying to go for that tag. Oh, and a huge counter from Drew. McIntyre knowing that probably he's in a little bit better shape than his partner, but I feel like after like two Coquina clutches that might take a toll on someone. <laughs> Good lord. Oh! Samoa Joe desperately trying to get his tag team partner into the mix. Oh my god. This match, folks, this match has been crazy. Huge tag made into Jacobs. How much more does she have left? Oh my god. Oh, and a huge counter from Natalia. Huge counter from Jacobs. Oh god, my controller padding just fell off. It's fine. And Natalia wisely getting out of this match. Oh, a huge meteora from Jacobs once again. Again, Jacobs trying to just put in everything into this matchup. Oh, and Natalia. Oh god. What is it going to take? Natalia. Oh, God. Drew wisely getting back into the mix, seeing that his partner was kind of in a little bit of a rough shape right there. Oh! Good lord, there's no chill. Alright, McIntyre with the Glasgow kiss into a pinfall attempt. Oh, and a two count! Oh god, what do these teams have to do to put each other away? Oh my god. Oh, and Joe counters! McIntyre was going for the future shock DDT. Joe knows that he is in rough shape and goes after Natalia, who is in equally rough shape. Oh! First person to connect with that big drop kick, another drop kick. Jacob's getting back into this mess. She's feeling a little bit of momentum. Huge knee right to the face. I think she's looking for it here. She's looking for it. Same move that she beat Natalia with last week on Raw. Joe breaking it up. Going for that pinfall attempt. Samoa Joe breaking things up. Tossing Jacobs over like that. That's... Oof, good lord. What is it going to take? Oh no. Top rope, here we go. Oh, okay, there's the padding. 
Oh god, I just like kicked my computer. Oh, what a huge Spanish fly! Okay, Jacobs knows that Samoa Joe is gonna try to go after her. So she's gonna bring her closer over to that corner. Is that what Jacobs is gonna need to get her team to win? And Joe somehow getting his nose at everything, which sounds about right. Huge leg drop on Natalia. My God. And Natalia kicks out at two. Oh, and a huge German suplex. Is this what? Is this the opening that Jacobs needs? Oh God. Both of the guys are out. This is not a drill. More so Joe than Drew. No, they're both out. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <coughs> Jacob's looking for something here. Springboard new salt does not connect. Tally with a huge punch. Huge, huge power slam right there. Huge counter. Oh, Natalia trying to go for that clothesline, the discus clothesline, but it does not pan out well for Jacobs. This is not a good spot for either team. Natalia getting in the tag on Samoa Joe. Double suplex, oh my god. What a match. And McIntyre, he's got to get this for the team. And Joe counters. Oh, what a huge gut buster, oh my god. Drew's got to get this for the team. That's kind of where they're at right now. But Jacobs is doing everything that she can to, like, stick in this match. There's no other way around it. All right. McIntyre's looking for it here. Can three be a charm? And a Claymore. And Natalia, uh, kind of just being a giant turd sandwich just now, and going for the referee. <laughs> <coughs> My god. Samoa Joe's got something going on here. McIntyre wisely getting out of the ring. Oh! McIntyre going for it here. Oh my god! Trying to fight fire with fire. Really digging deep into the movesets here. Oh my god. Y'all, these two teams better kind of stick around with each other after this whole challenge is over with. I'm just throwing that out there. Holy crap. This has been the best match of this, like, series so far, by far. Oh my god. This is like a pay-per-view caliber match right here. What we're witnessing is pay-per-view caliber. McIntyre being very smart, keeping him near the corner. And a pinfall attempt. And Natalia getting in the referee's nose once again, because of course. McIntyre's looking for it. And the future shock DDT. 
and the Talia getting her nose and everything with the friggin' referee once again. Folks, this thing is a hot mess. This match has been crazy. Um, I feel like this is going to have to be a two-part episode just because of just the insanity of this match. Alright, McIntyre's got the tag into Jacobs. What have they got in store here? Oh boy. Another huge double kick move right here. Oh, what a huge move. Oh, and Natalia kicks out. Oh my god. Could this be the opening that these two need? We're gonna find out. Natalia countering. Drop toe hold. Natalia with a front drop kick. <coughs> Jacob's wisely getting out of the ring just now. Trying to make her way back into this ring. Everybody's just countering each other. My God. And there goes the uh, controller padding once again. My God. <laughs> Y'all, your girl's gonna need a food break after this match, a well-earned food break. My freaking God. This has been crazy. Oh, and capitalizing with the clothesline. What a dirty, cheap trick right there. Oh, God, and a kick out. She somehow makes it out. Right, Natalia is looking to tag out, and she does. Joe, babe, Joe is back inside the ring. McIntyre going right for Drew, not holding back. Oh! Oh, and you're Nagi from Samoa Joe. Oh, and McIntyre kicks out at two. What do these teams need to do in order to get the big win here tonight? Oh, and a huge counter! Oh, God. So, Joe trying to vibe for something here. McIntyre looking for it. Future Shock DDT right in the corner. Natalia beating up that referee once again, which is kind of on brand at this point. Okay, uh, Mr. Referee, can you, like, be decent for once? Can we just start kicking out, like, referees and stuff? Like, Jesus Christ. This could very well, like, this match could be its own standalone video, and I would be, like, totally fine with it. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus. Natalia getting that tag back in. Hitting that running front drop kick right there. Is this the opening that Jacobs needs? She's got that clover leaf. She's gonna get it in. And Jacobs gets the big win with that clover leaf onto Natalia, folks. That was a clinic in mixed tag team action. Oh my god, folks. We're gonna have to go to a part two for this particular episode, I think. There was just so much that went on. I did not expect that match to be that long, but I am pleasantly surprised that it did. So, yeah, uh, this is going to have to go to a part two. 
Uh, but we will give you an updated bracket before this video ends. So, that way you all can see where we are at. Here are your winners, Christina Jacobs and Drew McIntyre. Actually, we're going to give you that updated bracket, like, at the beginning of the next video. I'm just going to throw that out there. Yeah, that was a freaking insane mixed tag team match. Uh, I may even upload this match as its own individual video, if that is cool with y'all. But we're going to have to go to a part two on this episode. So hang on to your butts. I'm not going to leave y'all hanging. So on that happy note, thank you all so much for tuning in. Part two is going to come up pretty much right after this video is uploaded. So yeah, in two weeks time on Raw. So two, yeah, not the next part. But yeah, you get my point. Uh, we will have the long-awaited rematch and next installment against Seth Rollins, Becky Lynch. We'll also get an update over on the SmackDown side, see how their bracket's turning out. But, get excited. We got a two-parter coming up for episode six. I'm excited. You should be excited. So, as always, thank you all. <laughs> oh, God. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Uh, again, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff here on YouTube. I also stream on Twitch. Uh, not as often as I would like to, uh, but that's because we're in the heat of the second half of the semester. And so on that happy note, uh, thank you all so much for tuning in. I will see you all later. Bye, everyone.